Gently, gently now. Don't brush her so hard or she will lose all her coat. Snowdrop's got to be the most beautiful goat at the show tomorrow. It's not a competition for the prettiest goat. The district representative said he'd choose the region's best goat milk. I know, but I still want her to be the prettiest. And thanks to the lovely harness Ariko made, she doesn't limp anymore. Come here, Snowdrop. Come here. What a beautiful goat you are, Snowdrop. <laughs> I'm sure you're going to win. Well... I really hope that my goat Goldfinch will win the medal and the 10 francs prize money. Thank you for your milk, little bear. Don't bet on it, Peter, because I'm certain that Snowdrop will give the most milk. <sighs> I guess we'll see. I took Goldfinch up to the Big Felt Meadow. That's where you find the best grass. If Snowdrop wins, I'll give the 10 francs to Grandfather, and then he won't have to work so hard all the time, you know? I'm really worried about him. Oh, it's all right. He's as strong as a mountain. Yes, that's true. Well, it's time I went back home now. Hey, wait for me! <laughs> what is he up to now? Are you all right, Grandfather? Rico still isn't back yet. Well, I'm sure he'll be back soon. I hope so. Right, I'm off. See you tomorrow, Heidi. See you tomorrow, Peter. <laughs> Smells good, Grandfather. We'll just have to start without him. What on earth can he be doing? He'll be all right, Grandfather. Do you think so? Mm, you know how agile he is. Well, that's no reason for being so late. <laughs> Quiet, Joseph. <laughs> 